to LA. So excited for this trip. I'm gonna be in LA for like two weeks. So just got to where I'm staying for the first part of the trip. <sighs> what a long day so far. <sighs> this is gonna be great. So I actually already had breakfast and um, or breakfast, lunch, so like brunch. And let's see what we get into for the rest of the day. So of course, we are doing an impromptu shoot on a rooftop. We are all doing this with codes. So let's see how this goes. Like you can really see the mountains and everything. So we just got to Wyoming Canyon. And We definitely just made lunch, smashed some red beans and avocados and shivo. Oh, yeah, Deb has cheese. Okay, so they're so fast, but these are the ones we always get. It's like a bully. And it always mm -hmm. comes in this double bag. Alright, try salt and straw. Yeah. This is very get out. Very. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even like vlog or anything like that because that's how focused I was and that's how hungry I was. But I think I'm gonna save the ice cream experience for this weekend because I'm so full. But this is such a cute little place. Oh yeah, Deborah's hair is black by the way, guys. What is this actually called? Like the uh, this is the Disney Studio lot. Disney Studio lot. Maybe do like down and then up. Okay. Okay. Oh. That's better. Ready? Ready? So now we're at the ABC studios where like we film a bunch of other ABC shows. Do that again. Hello, yeah, I'm trying to act like I've been somewhere, you know, just like chatting it up with all these people here. And no big deal. No big deal. Oh, wait, what? I'm not crying on the inside. <laughs> Shaking We're trying boots. to like, I can't even vlog because I'm trying to act like I've been somewhere. You know what I'm saying? Wait, when really, when really inside, I'm like, what is happening? How did we even get in here? How did this happen? So anyway, our girl is back over there chatting it up. Right there, you know, her. <laughs> Meanwhile, my hair is growing by the hour. <laughs> like, did you even cut it? I'm not sure. <laughs> So Deb is literally leaving today. I am back home, sad. and I'm gonna be here for like another month. Mm -hmm. Oh well, not really. <laughs> Ooh, we'll have some curls being naughty here. I so that. we're gonna go out and show you this.
just finished having. Where are we again? Rosa Mexicana. 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 It was amazing. Muy bien. Muy bien. Look at Spanish. So we literally every time we hook up, it's like a revival. So we were just talking about the the level of balance between being humble and confident, and like the need of women of faith to really walk in that. And so we just we're leaving so empowered. So I'm in the second half of my trip or like the second leg and um, I got to my hotel last night so I really couldn't appreciate the view that we really have but let me see if I can look at that view like the sun is right there oh my gosh I love it I would show you my actual room but it's a mess when you come in the room and your bed is made i literally just put my stuff down um i just came back from the field trip and registered got my bag situation i mean badge situation and um got my goodies so basically i cannot do english today basically what they do is give you like a swag bag or like a goodie bag and um just filled with a bunch of stuff and then the main sponsor of this event is neutrogena and so what they did was they basically provided us with a bunch of goodies here and basically it's everything in this pamphlet so I'm excited. It's just all those products into one little um, situation here. And then from the field trip, we got a bunch of little knickknacks from Instagram and Facebook. Oh, wait, that's not it. That's my water bottle. <laughs> um, so, like, you know, stuff like this, like stuff that says Instagram and heart. And then we got a swell bottle as well, which is great. 
I actually have one over here. Well, this was a different brand, I guess. I don't even know what that means. But anyway, this is another one, um, which is great. So my hair is fully dried. I actually wet it this morning. Um, and so for later, I'm going to like transform a little bit. And I mean, not too much. Oh, they give us a little thing. Um, but anyway, it dried. Thank God. And so I'm going to transform. I'm going to like try to look cute or whatever. And, um... And yeah, I just literally was daydreaming just now. Y'all, I don't know how to act with this robe right now. It's just so comfy. Did I show you on my vlog yet? No. No? We even have overnight gel mask. We have to do a mask thing. She's basically showing um her vlog which is are you still vlog, all vlog, things vlog. Ada, right yeah, all things Ada, and like she's showing them i literally just showed you guys like what we got in the um in the bags but like very general but she's really breaking it down yes, there's some goodies up in and here and showing all of this stuff so we got like masks we got all the skincare these are new they have to be uh, yeah I oh it is yeah this. it is tonight we have the welcoming party so that's gonna be exciting so i just got comfortable because the clothes i had on i just Mm, can't do it. I just need to be comfortable. They did not hesitate to be part of this. And that first year, how many of you were there in 2015? Yeah. Right? 2 of the We All Grow Summit is definitely off to a good start. We just got sent breakfast in bed. Ugh. Sponsored by Neutrogena. So thank you so much, Neutrogena, for feeding us. I'm so excited to get into this breakfast. I don't know. I have to get my workout in before anything. Like, I have to do this. All right, y'all. So I'm fixing up my hair. It's actually behaving because today is super rainy. Um, but it's behaving um and we're actually on our way to like some master class that we actually have to go with a bare face so ada and i are like mm, okay so we're gonna fill it out but we're on our way there now so let's see we don't know what to expect So today is one of the last days at um, We All Grow. It actually ends officially tomorrow, but I know a lot of people are probably leaving today. But this morning I woke up and I was just so overwhelmed by God's love. Like I'm just like looking at like the sunrise and like just reflecting on this trip to California and like all the people that I met within such a short amount of time and really just having a genuine connection and um people just pouring into me and like believing in me and um it's an it's it's another level when like yes you believe in yourself and yes you know you speak life into your ministry into your business into all these things and you believe god's word but 
it's like a whole nother thing when like people other human beings recognize that same power within you and realize that there's something special here and um you know and then that's that's just incredible that people see all of that you know in me and and I was just able to have just like I said really genuine conversations and connections with people and it's just like overwhelming because I'm like God like you know who am I you know I'm just who am I that you are so mindful of me and and you think of me and you love me so much and so I'm always reflecting on how much God really loves me and how much he really keeps me every time and everywhere I go and um do you see the sun getting like shinier on my face like what the heck <laughs> Wow, I can't even like open my eyes right now. Crazy. Let me show you guys. I already showed you guys this view, but like it just got mad sunny. <laughs> oh my god. What I do want to do is share is how we were able to rise back up and in that process understand our role in the evolution of our community. We are here because of the power of this community. The power of this sisterhood is what contained us. Option and choose that one despite the fear that it may bring. In fact, what's the best way to tell them apart? The growth choice is normally the scarier one. <laughs> so, once again, I asked myself, what's the best that can happen? I wrote down a list of all the possible rewards, and I focused on those. One of, one of the most valuable things that We All Grow has given me is the connection between myself and another fellow young widow. I'm a young widow myself, and I actually met another young widow here. And to be able to connect with her on this level because of We All Grow changed my life. Thank you, Carmen. Okay, and question number three. I've actually made one before. I love the scent. Um, I mean, it's herbal tea, it's caffeine. You guys, I just tried this the lemongrass and so it's good. Just the flowers and all good. I'm going to try to get And you guys are located in Wilmington? Yeah. Okay. Yes. Oh, wow. Yeah, man. Good? Guys, wait, <laughs> wait I don't okay, understand what's happening. Okay. Guys, this ain't even right. Oh, Should I hold that bag? Yeah. Oh, Wait, what is this? And then you can put that bag back over here. Okay. Okay. And put your feet, make sure that, that this. <laughs> Do 
got this amazing deal in this beautiful behind lock. <laughs> Pastelito de guayaba and queso. Look at that. It's so freaking cute. Alright, so this is my drink. It's the Co Havana Coconut Latte. I'm waiting on my human toast. Alright, so we're at BuzzFeed, right? And um, one of our friends work here. And they got all these snacks here. And look at all those <laughs> We're trying to fly out on a full stomach tonight on our flight. He started to sing the song. Look, even my kid walked into my house. Like, he's walking through a thing. Maya is showing up around. Well, y'all are eating snacks. <laughs> Alright, so I'm at my last stop for the night. Madre, Say hi, Ken. Hi. <laughs> yeah, this is what it's called. And it's like really cute. So I'm going to go to one side and have like a, like a greenery ball over there. 